There used to be a children's group uh, which my parents were involved in. In fact, Lakshmi's parents, uh, brothers were, and sisters were involved in this also. So it just got to a stage where I didn't know her that well in those days, but uh, uh, her family was involved, my family was involved. So we did various charitable things. Uh, not charitable, more community service activities, but it's it's been it's been almost a lifelong involvement. Yeah. One of the more exciting things I did oh, 10, 10, 12 years ago was took a group of disabled children, including hearing impaired and speech impaired, perhaps a better expression to use, um, bus them to Changi Airport. We were able to get the loan of a Qantas aircraft. We put them into the aircraft, took them for a flight around Singapore and Malaysia for about 45 minutes. But these kids, had never been near an aircraft. And to me, that's one of the more exciting things I did. Uh, Qantas, for instance, gave the aircraft as part of their community service program. Then we talked uh, the Changi Airport authorities in not charging the landing uh, and takeoff fees. We got the petrol company, uh, air fuel company, to not charge for the fuel for this particular flight. So, uh, and what we did was got uh, anybody who was interested to sponsor a child uh, with a minimum of a hundred dollars, some put in some more. So we had about a plane load, which is about 200 odd things. So we collected 200 into a hundred dollars for that, uh, for our charity community fund. So. To me, that was one of the highlights of my community. <laughs> it was unusual. Back to schools and colleges, junior colleges and all. Movements like the Interact movement that I mentioned, the sort of offshoot of Rotary, uh, there are genuine workers there who go out. Um, the Hua Chong institution that I'm an advisor of, uh, would have something like 40, 50 small programs every half year. And that's a lot of programs. It may be just going and cheering up somebody in uh, old folks home or taking a few people out or uh, this group went to um, Batam to a school there and painted the school walls and taught them some fundamental English terms and learnt a bit of Bahasa in the mean, in the, as a return. And he came back very, very excited by the whole thing. Uh, supported by the school, supported by us, but uh, there was genuine excitement in there, having gone there, cleaned up the toilets, got taught basic hygiene to these people. So, uh, now, there is a bunch of students who would be very happy to do that.